Okay, so I'm going to show you how to use a free app called Pick Collage to do some designing. So just to save a bit of time, I've already downloaded some images, but you could take your own photos if you want of like eyes or skin, um, lips, whatever. But I've gone for cells and inside the body, so you obviously can't take pictures of that. So here, I thought it would be quite nice if you did masks with the current situation. If you're going to get a picture from the internet, find something decent. Like this is a decent, cool, trendy sort of picture. Don't get like a cartoony one or a pixelated one. So I've just adjusted the size. And then you'll notice I haven't put it right to the bottom. I don't want it right at the bottom. So I'm just going to put them a little bit off center. Perfect. Click the tick. And then I'm going to add some pictures. So I've already downloaded some pictures. So I'm going to pick this one first. And you'll notice it comes out as a square. And I obviously don't want it as a square because it covers up his face. This is actually the coronavirus cell. So then I'm going to hold down and go to cut out. Click the scissors. You don't want the people one because that will try and make it a person. And it's clearly not a person. And then I'm just going to hold down and go around the edge. You, you won't get it perfect, so don't try. Lovely. And then it cuts everything out around. So if I click and hold the arrow down, just drag it in, you can adjust the size. So I'm going to do this a couple of times. Hold down, duplicate. Ooh, make sure if like there, the, the mask man moved. Just make sure you're tapped on the right one. So hold down, duplicate. So I'm going to do that just a couple there. And then I'm going to add a different one. I think it'll look quite nice with another one. So I'm going to add this one. This again is another coronavirus cell. So it's it's quite um, nice to be thinking about, you know, the current situation that we're in and do some designing around it. So this time I'm just going to do a different shape. Random, just like that. Cut out. Lovely. Drag my arrow in and... You can turn it so you have it facing different ways. Make it bigger, smaller. I'm just going to move that around. I'm going to duplicate another one of those. So hold down, duplicate. I'm just going to turn that. Might have that one. Looks like a little claw, like a little, little paw or something. I'm going to have that one like that, and then I'm. I'm going to go back to one of these. I quite like one of these ones. So I'm going to duplicate that one and just finish it off and layer these over the top like this. Don't worry if you go over like the, the mask that you're copying. That doesn't matter. As long as you don't, you don't see the main bit because you're obviously designing your own one. I'm just going to put one last one. Might need two. It does get a little bit fiddly. Um, on the last little bit, make sure you clicked on the right, the right one. It's only that last little bit. It's just where it's small and you're on your phone. See, so it's not letting me move it. That's because I've got sausage fingers. Duplicate just that last little bit because it's annoying me. So it's white just down there. And you can move them uh, to make different ones to the front or to the back. To duplicate that again. Don't want to see that white bit, can't have that. Perfect. That looks fabulous. So I'm just gonna click away and move it away from my from my eyes. Lovely. That is good. Mask number one done. Click done. Save to gallery, but you'll notice this really annoying pit collage watermark on there. Save. We don't want that, so I'm gonna go into my gallery. And I'm going to crop this. So edit, crop, get rid of that before you send it to me. Save. Perfect. Lovely first design illustration, digital illustration, whatever you want to call it. Done.